Welcome to our YouTube channel, Na Solving Math with Leonelin. Now let's answer a question from one of our followers. A rectangular lot 60 feet long and 30 feet wide is to be surrounded by fence with posts 6 feet apart. If the corner post costs 250 pesos and the remaining post 150 pesos each, what is the cost of all the posts? Mas magandang i-post nyo muna yung video ito para kayo na muna ang sasagot bago nyo makita yung mismong solusyon natin dito. Pero bago ang lahat para sa mga first time pa sa channel ko, ito yung FB natin. Huwag na kayong mag-PM dyan, tambak na yung mga messages. Kung meron kayong concern, pwede kayong mag-PM dito sa Free Reviewers Managed by Leonalyn. Otherwise, kung naghahanap kayo ng mga libreng printable na reviewers, punta na lang kayo sa files. Sa FB group na to, Philippine Civil Service Review for All. At ito naman yung iba pang mga FB groups na lagi nating tinatambayan. Now, let's read the problem again. A rectangular lot, 60 feet long, 30 feet wide, is to be surrounded by a fence with posts 6 feet apart. If the corner post... Uh, if the corner post costs 250 pesos and the remaining post 150 pesos each, what is the cost of all the post? Let's do solution number one. Yung mag-drawing tayo para mas ma-visualize nyo. So, ito yung unang post. Six feet apart. Kunwara, yan yung six feet. Now, yung mismong Length niya, ilang 6 feet ba ito para yung mismong total ng length ay 60? Anong gagawin natin? 60 divided by 6 and that is 10. So therefore, meron tayong 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So 10 na 6 feet yan. Total niya ay 60. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yung width naman natin. 30 divided by 6 and that is 5. So therefore, may lima tayo dito. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 30 feet yan siya na merong tag 6 feet apart yung mismong post. Ito yung mismong corner sa post. So, ito yung corner, ito yung corner. So, bali, meron din tayo dito. Ito naman yung corner. Meron tayong apat na corner. 1, 2, 3, 4. So, ito ay 4 times 2.5. 2.50 pesos. So, equal to 10. Next, ilan yung nandito? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 yan siya. At huwag yung kalimutan, pariho lang ding merong 13 dyan. So, 13 plus 13 equals 26. Yung 26 na yan, magkano yan? Tag 150. So, i-multiply natin sa 150. And this is exactly equal to 39. So, 10 plus 39, this is equal to 49. So, ang sagot dito ay 49 pesos. Now, let's do solution number 2. Wait, delete muna natin ito. So, itong solution number 2 natin, dapat alam, alam natin niya yung rectangular na yan, meron niyang dalawang 60 feet. Meron din niyang dalawang 30 feet. O ang width niya at saka yung length, tag dalawa yan siya. So, this is 120 and this one is 60. A total of 
180 feet. I-divide natin yan sa 6 feet. Kasi 6 feet apart daw. So, i-divide natin ng 6. 180 divided by 6. And this is 30. So, bali merong 30 na post. Remember na itong 30 na ito, merong 4 dyan. So, minus 4 na corner posts. So, 30 minus 4, that is equal to 26. Now, yung 4 na yan, dito natin i-multiply sa 2.5 or 250 pesos. Yung 26, dyan natin i-multiply naman sa 150 pesos. So, 4 times 250 or 4 na 250, this is 10. 10 pesos. Ito naman, 26 times 250. 150, and this is 39 pesos. So, ang total nito ay 49. Kaya ang sagot dito ay 49 pesos. Thank you for watching and all I hope mayroon kayo naintindihan sa video ito. Thank you and God bless.